Hello everyone, uh, it's Timothy Miller here, the North American Coordinator for Radar Opus, and today I want to show you some of the features and the functionality of TBR2 within Radar Opus. Now TBR2 in Radar Opus is divided into three parts. We've got the repertory portion, we've got concordances or the family portion, and we also have the text portion, which is where we have George Demetritus's endnotes, footnotes, and incredible text that you can read as a book um, with all the additional information that he's compiled. Now, in Writer Opus, once you have access to and have purchased TBR2, if you go under your maps and you click on it, within, within the maps, you'll see that we have Demetritus George, the Benninghausen Repertory. If we click on that, this window will appear. What we can do is by clicking once, Right here, what says you can open all parts with one click, it will open all three sections, the repertory, the concordances, as well as the text piece. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that with one click. I now see that over here, all these windows are opening, that screen exits out, and I've got the three parts of the Benninghausen Repertory Second Edition. Right here, we've got the text portion, um, which functions just as a book, all of this text is fully searchable. We'll see that we've got the end notes. We've got uh, different headings. I can click right here on these binoculars. And over here will give me a breakdown of the different sections. And I can go in and click on the things that I might like to read and follow up with. So this is the text portion. Over here, we have both the concordances portion and the repertory portion, the therapeutic pocketbook. If I click here on concordances, it will take me to concordances, and I'm able to look at the similar remedies, as well as remedies that may antidote, et cetera, um, in the concordances portions of TPR2. In order to access the repertory, I just click on this little arrow and get back to the repertory. Now, searching is super easy. Just as within other repertories of Raider Opus, we've got several options for finding rubrics. The first that we'll start with is the search feature. So if I click on search um, right now, right now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna type in, let's just do sleep and let's do a heavy sleep, okay? Right now, if you see, right here it's selected to search in all documents. So over here, all the repertories and Materia Medica and everything that I have access to, it's going to search through those resources. What I can do is I can change search in all documents to search in all open documents. So because I only have all of George Demetritus's documents, the repertory, the concordances, as well as the text piece, if I click on this, instead it's going to narrow my search to only include Demetritus's results. So that can be kind of helpful, allows you to filter out and narrow down to see what you actually want to be looking for. Now, so I did that. What I can do, just as I can do with any other repertory within Radar Opus, is I've got two options. One, I can click and drag this rubric into the clipboard. That's option number one. Or option number two, what I can do is double click and it will take me to that section within the book, okay? And I again can do the same thing. I can take and click and scroll. Now, of course, it's reminding me that I've already got a second uh, of the same rubric, so we don't need to add that back into the clipboard. But I simply do that to demonstrate what the options are for adding rubrics into the clipboard. Now, that's option number one. Another option that you can do is while you're in here, while you're in the repertory itself, you can start typing in the text. So if you know the rubric you want, you can start typing in the text. So let's say I wanna type in modalities, and then I wanna type in from foods, and I simply start typing and I can hit enter and it will take me to the next screen, and let's say from milk. So I've got a modality, we've got aggravation and amelioration, and let's say we want milk aggravates. So by clicking enter, it takes me to that rubric. And see, I've got here, I've got milk aggravates, or I could do ameliorated, which we'd have veratrum. 
So here, uh, same thing, I can click and scroll and allow myself to go back to the clipboard. If I click this clipboard, it allows me to see thus far the analysis that I've got from those two rubrics. If we wanna go back to the repertory, all we need to do is click here and we've got access the repertory, okay? Let's search for another rubric. So let's go back to our search window and in here, let's clear out the results. To clear, we can just clear all searches and that allows us to start on a fresh slate. So now let's just type in nausea, let's type in stomach. Again, you'll see that it's searching only in open documents, so it's limiting all of my search results to George Demetritus's work. <clears throat> and here, let's say that we wanna do this one. Systemic, alimentary, digestive dysfunctions, nausea and vomiting, nausea, stomach in the, okay? So we can, again, we can click and drag, or we can double click, and it takes us to that rubric, and we can add that to the clipboard. I can go right back to a search, I can cancel this out, and I can add in something else if I wanted to. Um, so why don't we do, we had done milk aggravates, what if we do, let's do chocolate. There we go. So we got, we don't have chocolate, but we do have eggs. So if we look at this again, same thing. Is it from the odor of the eggs or is it from the eggs themselves? So I can add another rubric if I want to click and it adds that fourth rubric into this clipboard. I can go to the analysis and I can look at the repertization results. Okay. So to recap, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to close out all of the windows here so that you can see how the search functionality works within Raider Opus for TBR2. The easiest way to pull up all of those three parts is to click on Maps, to click on Demetritus George, the Benninghausen Repertory, to click right down here, and it opens up all of those windows. I can easily go through the text portion, the repertory portion, or the concordances portion. By clicking on this little downward arrow, I can go back and forth between the repertory, the therapeutic pocketbook, and concordances, okay? When searching for a rubric, I've got several options. The first option is I can just simply be in the rubric, or excuse me, within the repertory, and start typing. So if I already know the rubric I want, I can start typing it. That was what we did, if you remember, I started typing M for modalities, and that populates, I can click on it, I can click on it, and then it brings me to this window. I can click from food and drink, and then I can click on milk like we had done previously, and then I can click go to, and it will take me to that rubric. And I can then there click and drag into the clipboard. Now again, we've already got this in there, so we don't need to add it again, but that's an option, okay? The other thing that we can do is we can actually open up a search. As we did with the example of stomach nausea, we can search. Now, right now, it's searching in all documents that I have access to. So we'll see, we've got all the repertories, all of the Materia Medica, all of the references, everything that I have access to within my version of Raider Opus, it's going to show me. Now, let's say that we only want to look at TBR2. So easy. All we need to do is limit this to all open documents. And this is going to limit to the three parts of TBR2. From here, again, we've got the option of clicking and dragging and scrolling in, or we can go straight to the rubric. We can oscillate back and forth between the search window and between the repertory itself going back and forth. The last thing that I just want to point out um, is when you're within the therapeutic pocketbook, if you click on the binoculars, it will take you to the very opening of the chapters. 
So we've got regional, systemic, general, and modalities. You can go back and forth going up and down, systemic. Let's say we wanna look at urinary, we wanna look at urination, the flow of urine by drops, we can click on that, um, and we can go to that rubric. And we can add that back in, and uh, that's another option for you if you wanna search by all the general chapters, and then break it down into different systems, finding rubrics that you want, okay? So, I hope this has been helpful for you. Uh, TBR2 is a fantastic tool. We do have a webinar that is available um, from George Demetritus himself, highlighting some of the history and philosophy and um, different parts of the Benninghausen repertory and um, how it can be a helpful piece of your practice. Um, and I'll include that link on this YouTube video uh, below in the notes section so that you can, you can refer to it if you so desire. All right, well, thanks for joining, and I hope you're having a wonderful day.